Hey everybody, it's Nick Jonides, uh, running coach, personal trainer, health and wellness coach, and race director. Um, I am here uh, to talk today about the one thing that you need to do with every exercise cycle uh, is rest. I don't know how many people incorporate rest, but that's just as important as doing whatever exercise you're doing. Number one, you have to always um, do whatever exercise it is. Try to stick to your schedule, whatever the schedule may be. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, go to the gym. Tuesday, Thursday, we do some Pilates class, whatever it is. But somewhere in there, you should incorporate rest. Rest helps you move forward. Rest helps you recover your muscles. Rest helps you move to the next level. Whatever the sport may be, if you don't have any rest, you do not do well. Very simple. Um, there's people who never take any day, days off. Hey, George, Merry Christmas. Um, there's people who take no days off and they brag about it. They talk about it, how I'm always exercising. But in the end, they'll improve, but they'll hit a plateau. And then eventually they're in a position to get injured because there's not enough time for your, your muscles to rest and your body to rest. And then it's possible they'll get injured. Okay, now again, most of us are no longer 21 years old, so it's even more important to get rest. Uh, as for running, I try to get at least one day off per week or every two weeks, but as I age, I tend to think that I need more rest, and that's doing not running. Um, for some people, th their exercise may just be another sport, but also at some point you need to totally recharge. So I recommend every few weeks or every few months, you take off an entire week from no exercise. Doesn't mean you can't go get a massage. Doesn't mean you can't go do something relaxing like acupuncture or a chiropractor visit, something to have yourself recover. But you just need to get away from your sport. Um, three, those the times when high schoolers are do, did three sports like football, basketball, baseball, are slowly going away. They only do the same sport all year round and they have special individualized coaches for whatever. Um, again, they improve, but again, it puts them in more position to get injured. Just look at all the high schoolers that have baseball in injuries from, um, from pitching too much and such. So anyway, make sure the one thing you get out of this is that you rest, not perpetually rest and never exercise. That's completely the opposite what I'm saying is it makes sure that, if, especially if you have a nice schedule that you have in your life, that in, you incorporate rest. Uh, also, if you have a coach for whatever your particular sport is, make sure that they're working with you to get the rest that you need. And again, as if you're recovering from injury or as you get older, you need definitely need more rest. Uh, obviously, I am me with more questions on the subject or ask me questions. And for those that celebrate any of the holidays there this week, so Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, and any other restive, restful week. Hopefully you're with your families and everything is going well. I'll talk to you soon.